The cellular frequencies are the sets of frequency ranges within the ultra-high frequency band that have been allocated for cellular phone use. All cellular phone networks worldwide use a portion of the radio frequency spectrum designated as ultra-high frequency, or UHF, for the transmission and reception of their signals. The ultra-high frequency band is also shared with television, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth transmission. For historical reasons, radio frequencies used for cellular networks differ in the Americas, Europe, Africa and Asia. The first commercial standard for mobile connection in the United States was AMPS, which was in the 800 MHz frequency band. In Nordic countries of Europe, the first widespread automatic mobile network was based on the NMT450 standard, which was in the 450 MHz band. As mobile phones became more popular and affordable, mobile providers encountered a problem because they couldn't provide service to the increasing number of customers. They had to develop their existing networks and eventually introduce new standards, often based on other frequencies. Some European countries adopted TACS operating in 900 MHz. The GSM standard, which appeared in Europe to replace NMT450 and other standards, initially used the 900 MHz band too. As demand grew, carriers acquired licenses in the 1800 MHz band. In the US, the analog AMP standard that used the cellular band was replaced by a number of digital systems. Initially, systems based upon the AMP's mobile phone model were popular, including AS-95 and AS-136. Eventually, AS-136 on these frequencies was replaced by most operators with GSM. GSM had already been running for some time on US PCS frequencies. And, some NMT450 analog networks have been replaced with digital networks using the same frequency. In Russia and some other countries, local carriers received licenses for 450 MHz frequency to provide CDMA mobile coverage area. Many GSM phones support three bands or four bands, and are usually referred to as tri-band and quad-band phones, or world phones. With such a phone one can travel internationally and use the same handset. This portability is not as extensive with IS-95 phones, however, as IS-95 networks do not exist in most of Europe. Mobile networks based on different standards may use the same frequency range. For example, AMPS, DAMPS, NAMPS and IS-95 all use the 800 MHz frequency band. Moreover, one can find both AMPS and AS-95 networks in use on the same frequency in the same area that do not interfere with each other. This is achieved by the use of different channels to carry data. The actual frequency used by a particular phone can vary from place to place, depending on the settings of the carrier's base station. Frequency bands recommended by ITU ITU are approved in June 2003 the following bands to the terrestrial mobile telecommunication IMT 2000, 806 a Euro 960 a megahertz, 1710 a Euro 2025 a megahertz, 2110 a Euro 2200 a megahertz and 2500 a Euro 2690 a megahertz. United States carrier frequency use, frequency bands by region. United States, professional wireless microphones used the 700 MHz band until 2010 when they were made illegal, but equipment still exists and use that may interfere with 3G and 4G technologies. The usage of frequencies within the United States is regulated by the Federal Communications Commission. The U.S. is then divided geographically into a number of trading areas. A mobile operator must bid on each trading area individually. A bidder can use the frequency spectrum for whatever purpose they want. The 869 Euro 894 MHz cellular band is divided into two frequency blocks. There are 306 metropolitan service areas and 428 rural service areas. Each trading area consists of one or more counties. The 1850 Euro 1990 MHz PCS band is divided into six frequency blocks. Each block is between 10 MHz and 30 MHz bandwidth. License is granted for major trading areas. License is granted for basic trading areas. 
license, where issued, is granted for economic areas. There are 51 MTAs, 493 BTAs and 175 EAs in the United States. A. 1850 a Euro 1865 a Megahertz and 1930 a Euro 1945 a Megahertz. B. 1870 a Euro 1885 a Megahertz and 1950 a Euro 1965 a Megahertz. C. 1895 a Euro 1910 a Megahertz and 1975 a Euro 1990 a Megahertz. D. 1865 a Euro 1870 a Megahertz and 1945 a Euro 1950 a Megahertz. E. 1885 a Euro 1890 a Megahertz and 1965 a Euro 1970 a Megahertz. F. 1890 a Euro 1895 a Megahertz and 1970 a Euro 1975 a Megahertz. G. 1910 a Euro 1915 a Megahertz and 1990 a Euro 1995 a Megahertz. The AWS bands, auctioned in the summer of 2006, were for 1,710 a Euro 1,755 a megahertz, and 2,110 a Euro 2,155 a megahertz. The spectrum was divided into blocks, A blocks were for cellular market areas, based on existing cellular licenses, and were 2 a 10 a megahertz. B and C blocks were for basic economic areas larger than CMAs, usually comprising large portions of single states. D, E, and F blocks covered huge areas of the country, typically several states at a time, and covered 2 a, 5 a megahertz for D and E blocks, 2 a, 10 a megahertz for F. The 700 a megahertz band was auctioned in early 2008 using spectrum previously used by television stations analog broadcasts with Verizon Wireless and AT&T Mobility winning the majority of available spectrum. Qualcomm and Ecostar were winners of a significant amount of broadcast-oriented spectrum. Verizon Wireless will use the upper band of the 700 MHz spectrum to deploy their LTE network starting on December 5, 2010. The SMR 800 MHz band was used exclusively for IDEN technology, however, Sprint Corporation is deploying CDMA and LTE technology on this band. As of September 2, 2011, the FCC has approved several CDMA devices for use on the SMA band. More bands are under consideration for auction by the FCC. These are currently used by DoD, NASA, and other government agencies. Cellular and PCS bands are also used in other countries in the Americas. Other regions, See also, detailed lists, bands by technology, GSM frequency bands, UMTS frequency bands, EUTRA frequency bands and channel bandwidths. Deployed networks by technology, list of HSDPA networks, list of LTE networks, list of UMTS networks, list of deployed WiMAX networks. Deployed networks by country, list of mobile network operators of Europe. List of mobile network operators of the Americas, List of mobile network operators of the Asia-Pacific region, List of mobile network operators of the Middle East and Africa, List of mobile network operators. Mobile country code, code, frequency, and technology for each operator in each country, Other articles, comparison of mobile phone standards, 3GPP, roaming, dual band, tri-band, quad band, 700 MHz wireless spectrum auction, microwave, 4G, 3GPP long-term evolution, Title 47 of the Code of Federal Regulations, References External links, Wireless Advisor, FCC, New Bands Considered by FCC, Spectrum Frequency Chart, Most Common Ford Link Frequencies and Channelization